Good day and welcome to Arise. I'm very, very excited and happy to be with you back in the Word, which is very important. I want to talk to you today about marked moments, moments that define your destiny, moments that you, if you talk about powerful times and, and exciting moments in your life, you talk about that moment. You talk about a moment that God changed your whole life because of what somebody said, what somebody did, and the people that you met. And today, I really believe that we are in a marked time. We are, we, are, we are in a specific time. God called us for this time. God called us for this era. And God is about to do mighty things. And I want you to really be attentive to the voice of the Holy Spirit. And I want to say to you, if you are tuned in today, and you're not a born-again Christian, you, you have not accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior, I want to... I want to talk to you and say to you today, it is very important that you receive Jesus Christ in your heart, in your life, and make him the center of your whole being, because you will be surprised what this Jesus of Nazareth can do. And I want to talk to you today about moments that defines your whole destiny, moments that defines your life, people that you meet in an instant that changes the course of your walk in Christ. And don't think that is coincidence. That is divine appointments that God strategically predestined before the foundations of the earth. If we look at Ruth, the book of Ruth 2 verse 5, it says, Then Boaz said to his servant who was set over the reapers, Whose maiden is this? He was talking about Ruth who was gleaning behind the reapers in the fields that belonged to Boaz. And Boaz saw her, and that moment was a marked moment for Ruth. You know why it was marked? Because it changed the course of her destiny. Not just her destiny, but also Boaz's death destiny. And you know what? When purpose meets, it works both, both ends. The person that you meet, their life are changed and your life is changed. You know why? Because purpose met purpose, destiny met me destiny. And that was a defined moment. He says, whose maiden is this? He was looking at her and he was saying, who is this? And God, that, that moment was marked in the history of the Bible to the point that it was written in the book that is above every book, the word, the Bible. And I wanna talk about another incident it was when Jesus was, Jesus was never on his way to Samaria, to Samaria. He was passing through Samaria, but he went to the well because there was somebody, there was a lady that he needed to meet, the woman at the well. And Jesus spoke with her and Jesus asked her, who's your husband? And there was many. And Jesus said to her, the one that you have now is not even your husband. And Jesus, a Jew, spoke into a Samaritan woman's life. And it marked the course of her destiny to the point that she went back to Samaria. She spoke to the people. I, always want to, I almost want to say in the village. She spoke to the people in the village about this man who spoke about her whole life. And not just did he change her life, but he changed Samaria. He changed the nation. He changed her generation. I want to quickly tell you, marked moments will change the direction of your life. Marked moments is when people will have conversations with you that will bring you in alignment with your destiny and your purpose. Marked moments can be a conversation. Marked moments can be a meeting taking place. Marked moments can be something that I see on television. Marked moments can be something that I read that will change the way I look at things. And I want to tell you, today is a marked moment in your life. I pray today in Jesus' name that this minute in your life will change the course of your life because you are called for destiny. Until next time, God bless.